Hey, what's up, people? This is Panarius. So welcome back to The Last of Us Part 2. So, we are continuing where the last episode left off, and Dina's pregnant. That's what we learned in the last episode, and Ellie said some not-so-nice things, So, but I'm pretty sure she didn't mean it. But we're going to go ahead and make sure this place is secure. We're actually doing pretty well on ammo right now, now that I look at it. Just making sure everything is reloaded. Yeah, we're going to need some more shotgun ammo. Let's see if we can actually... Yeah, we'll make another Molotov. I'll probably regret that later. But let's go ahead and make another one of these as well. Alright. Let's get back at it. Let's see what this place has to offer. So when we walked into this place, all this stuff was barricaded. So I'm pretty sure there's somebody here. But I guess we'll see. Alright, nothing over there. We can check out that room. We can also go upstairs, okay? That'll be another place we can go. We can go through here. All right, cool. Just checking out all the places that we can actually go through. Let's check this room out first. So it looks like we're in a movie theater. Do I have a bottle? Okay, I do. Just in case. That last bathroom we went to a couple episodes ago has traumatized me. So I'll make sure to have a bottle in my hand whenever I walk into a bathroom. I will not be caught off guard again. All right, I don't think I should check these stalls individually, so we're just gonna keep on moving. All right, let's check out this room over here before we go upstairs. Oh, locked. Okay, that's not, needs a key, okay. Maybe there's a upstairs office that we can find a key. Pregnant. Yeah, man. Fucking pregnant. How could you keep something like that? I mean, I understand, because this whole thing is very important to Ellie, so she didn't want to mess anything up, but still. Alright, September 4th. Me, Perez, Green, and Adams made it to the listening post two days ago, and so far so good. WLF haven't come looking here yet. The city's lost to the WLF. We escaped headquarters out of sheer luck and good timing. Torres, Ward, and the others are probably dead, camping here. Grateful to be alive for now. September 6th. Can't sleep. Burning up with the fever, no medicine, looked everywhere. We don't have anything except the uniforms on our back. No contact from anyone on the radio either. How many of us made it out? September 7th, still feverish, don't have any big cuts, so probably not an infection. The others are waiting until nightfall, then making a run to the hospital to get medicine for me and supplies for wherever we're going next. They're good guys. September 10th, shouldn't be taking this long. I'm guessing whoever went out for supplies okay. never returned. This note's old. Still, better be careful. Maybe Tommy came in here. That'd be interesting. Maybe he found his way to this place because the door was open when we walked in here. So it's possible that Tommy could be somewhere around here. I don't know. Hopefully he's still alive. Because that would suck. Employee only. Okay. We did not check downstairs, but we should be good. Okay, so that's the way out. You know what? We'll come there later. I have a feeling that's going to kick something off. We good? Doesn't seem like there's anything in here. Okay, I think we're good. Fedra. What's this? September 13th. I don't think they're coming back. They're not coming back. Either got ambushed or they ditched me. Not my fault I got sick. At least the fever is gone. But now I'm fucking starving. Can probably raid the buildings nearby for food, then see if I can raise someone on the radio. September 15th. Constant rain means I at least won't die of thirst. Unfortunately, it keeps making the electricity conk out all the time. Makes it kind of hard to use the radio. Not like anyone's answering anyway. The WLF can't have hit all the federal listening posts. No way. Need to keep trying. September 16th. Dreamt they were laughing as I slowly bled out from a gut shot. Woke up an hour ago, still shaking. Need a cigarette. You'd think there'd be a pack or two stashed somewhere in the fucking theater, but apparently not this one. September 19th. Power went out again. Going to head to the roof to see if I can get it back on. Okay, so there's a generator on the roof. That should be interesting. Okay, nothing over there. This looks like a projector. I want to see if we can get to the theater. I think that might be what that locked door is. Is the main theater. 
can I use this? Oh no, I have to turn the power on. But who will we be contacting? Maybe we can listen in on them. Nope, we need power, Ellie. Need to get the power going. Yep, we sure do. Okay, so obviously the power's out there. We're gonna come back up here. Cause I wonder if half open windows are the same as half open doors where it triggers the next cutscene. And I definitely want to keep looking. What was that? I definitely want to keep looking before we get into that. All right, this bar is done. Let's check out down here. We're still looking for a key to get into the main theater. God, it's so dark down there. Skip my bot already. You never know what's gonna pop out. I don't think Ellie's ever been to a movie theater now that I think about it. Ooh, playing card. Beyond trading card. You look like a hero. Let's see. Yep, you're definitely a hero. Cool. I think we'll read all these cards as we get to the end of the game. But right now, I'm just going to pick them up and keep moving. There was nothing else back here but the trading card. No way for me to climb up. Okay. Looks like we're going back to the window. Alright, so that was up here. Let's go find that generator. Okay, generator. Looks like we gotta go up. We can also kick this down, I think. Maybe this is our way out when we officially leave this place. Gosh, this rain. That part in the last episode running from all those clickers was intense. We almost got a perfect run, but I ran right into a clicker and got myself bit. I actually just got finished editing all those episodes. So all that stuff should be done and I'm ready to record a whole new batch of episodes. Outside look like a lot yeah. of places for cover. You get fried? Guess you weren't much of an electrician. Jeez. That sucks. Can we fix this? Alright, let's do it. At least there's gas. Got it. Awesome. God. Don't want to touch that. Probably end up dead. Alright, let's get back to that radio. Wait, scrap? It's so hard to see scrap sometimes. Can't go that way. Alright, guess we'll go back this way. Gosh, it is raining hard. I know Seattle is known for its rain. So I probably should have expected that. I think we can climb faster. Come on, Ellie. There we go. Nope. <laughs> Not what I wanted to do. There we go. Alright, let's check out this radio. Hey, keys. What's this? <laughs> A little bit of anger fixed our key problem. Okay. Oh, man. Alright, well, that was a bust. But not really, because we found the keys. Alright, let's check down here again. Okay, all the lights didn't come on down there. Alright, we're good over here. Wait, can we get over there? I don't think we can. Alright, let's go down. Let's open that door to the main theater. She's still good, Dina? Yeah, she's still sleeping. Why is this place creepier with the lights on? Is it just me? Or is this place creepier with the lights on? Alright. The first key worked? That's pretty damn lucky, Ellie. Alright, that's nothing. Nothing over there. Guess we can go down this aisle. I don't think there's going to be anything over there. Who knows? There probably is. I'm sure I'm missing something. Okay, nothing over there. What's this? Just looks like some sound equipment. Alright, let me check up here real quick. Just in case. You never know. 
Okay. Absolutely nothing. Wow. Oh, Joel. You'd love watching a movie in this place. Yeah, you probably would. Okay. Looks like we can go through the curtains here. What's this? Sick habit. Oh, that band they were talking about in the, um... Frat. In the... In the... The record store. The Sick Habit with Brick Sick Shit Houses. Pinnacle Theater. $25 at the door. Sick Habit set list. Settle for less. Who can say? What's more onto the breach? Hideout. Running towards my problems. Possession. The light of two minds. Encore. Armstrong and Holly. QED. Okay. Well, that's that. Let's get through here. Okay. No way. What did you find? Oh, guitar. Another guitar. Oh boy, another guitar. Maybe you can make up what you said to Dina. Seems like they animated a bunch of these scenes. Okay. Time for another demonetized episode. <laughs> Chill song. Yeah, this song sums up everything. Three years earlier. This doesn't sound like so. Oh, I suck. <sighs> Just need to build up your calluses, that's all. Yeah. All right, come on. Does it? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, we're actually playing the flashback? I'm gonna start guessing. All right, here you we go. You spoil your surprise now. Oh, no. Is it a dinosaur? Stop trying to guess. I ain't telling you. <sighs> All right. Is it an elephant? <sighs> Is it a convertible? You're not gonna guess. Is it a puppy? Is it a lot of kittens? <laughs> you mean a litter? What's a litter? A bunch of kittens. Why wouldn't you call it just a bunch of kittens? I don't know what it's called a litter. This is depressing. Oh god. Oh boy. Alright, let's go. Step. I got it. Oh, that's evil. Yep, we can swim now. <laughs> what is wrong with you? You should see your face right now. What am I drown? No, you're not gonna drown. You gotta work on that confidence, kiddo. <laughs> yeah, keep laughing, old man. Let's see what happens. It's this way. The worst. Hold L on the swim faster. Your swim is getting better. Remember now, don't just flail about. You Push gotta push the water with your whole arm. Blah blah blah. Glad <laughs> to know I'm getting through. Hey, come here. Take a look at this. See that deer over there? 
See there. It? Just through there, look. Yeah. I see it. Can we push him? Come on. Looks like... There we go. You had to know that was coming. How's that feel? Uh, refreshing. Yeah, it's not nice getting pushed in, is it? Well, actually, we need to swim through this part anyway. I got you back. You're angry and upset. I am very angry and upset. Now, come on. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, there's no cell phones to worry about, so getting pushed in the water is perfectly fine. You're gonna need to dive under here. Take a deep breath. Yeah, I got this. Circle or square? Which one? I'm guessing circle. Yep. This is nice. Depressing, but nice. Is it... my sixth grade history teacher wanting to apologize for being a massive dick? <laughs> I beg your pardon? My friend and I would argue whenever he called the Fireflies terrorists. We got a lot of detention. You know, you really... Need to stop letting people rile you up. It's hard when they're dicks. Point still stands. All right, got another dive over here. Where right. are you taking me? Let's go, Joel. Try to keep up. Okay, never mind. Okay, I'll try to keep up with you. Seeing as it didn't let me go ahead. All right, I can see my breath meter on the side, but my mic stand is blocking is it. it. So I'm gonna try not to drown. New pair of sneakers. How many of those do you have? Not enough. Come on, Joe, you got this. There. Thank you. Okay. Fuck it. I'm done guessing. Well, good. But. Like, is it a massive comic book collection? No, wait. A new DVD collection? <sighs> yes. <laughs> That's, which one? Just, oh. yes. How about laser discs? I heard that's a thing. All right, let's go. Come on, Joel. I guess I'll lead the way. Looks like it's a little lake. Are we swimming again? Oh, it is a dinosaur. Shit, Joel. We're here. It oh is a God, dinosaur. It is a dinosaur. <laughs> and it is. Joel. Surprise. Holy shit. Wow. Oh, it's a motherfucking dinosaur. That's awesome. Yeah. So this is the day she was talking about that little uh that brochure that we found in Joel's house. She's like, that was a good day. Are we climbing the dinosaur? You're insane, right? Oh, we're climbing the dinosaur. What are you doing? Uh, uh, Ellie, be, be careful. I'm climbing a dinosaur! <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Just don't die falling off of one. No promises. Me! I'm on a motherfucking dinosaur! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? Don't jump. Just climb down. Oh, no. We have to jump. Come on, Ellie. I got you. Ah! Hey, hey. <laughs> That's great. Oh, man. He probably thinks we died. Oh, did you see that? Fearless. Yeah, I saw that. Oh, Give him a heart attack. Awesome. <laughs> it's awesome that you didn't break anything. Oh, that was awesome. Poor Joel. Let's grab that. What's this? Uh, it's a book. <laughs> it's a dinosaur book. Okay. All right. Let's try not to swim anymore and mess this thing up. 
Do we look around? Is that what we do? I know there's no stuff to keep, but I think we're gonna look around. Got my flashlight. Oh, hello. Sorry, the dinosaurs are busy right now. What are you doing? Oh, wait. One of the dinosaurs is here. <laughs> Joel, it's for you. Very funny. That was pretty funny. That was a good one, Ellie. Did you get it? It's because you're old. No, oh, I get it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's get back out there. Let's go check over here. Sorry, Joel. You don't bring a girl to uh, the Wyoming Museum and not expect her to look around. Oh, man. You want to try it on? I do not. Hmm. You're Suit lost. yourself. Too bad we don't have those coins. Yep. This place is cool. Too bad there's not much here. Ooh, what's this? Oh, look at those talons. A velociraptor? Is a velociraptor. Actually, it's a D Dionicus. Mm, pretty sure these are velociraptors. <laughs> yeah. I mean, at least that's what they called him in this movie I saw. Jurassic Park? Hmm. <sighs> Alright. Let's keep moving. What do you got over here? Another one of those coin machines? Yep, 51 cent machines. Platinum. Legacy. Did it say Jackson? Jackson County Community Foundation. President's Club, Dollar Honor Wall. These must be all the donors. Gals with guitars. That's cool. Rustin Inc. That's that coffee shop we saw a couple episodes ago. Rustin's Coffee. Weston's Pharmacy. Okay. Interesting. Got anything in the say, Joel? No? Okay. Let's keep moving. Ooh, what are these? Oh, these little shits. I know these things. Ooh, that's a big name for little guys. Yeah, They're annoying. Swarm you. Yep, exactly. What's up, Joel? that in a movie, too? Actually, yeah. <laughs> but a different one. See, there's a sequel. Jurassic Park 2. Wasn't as good. Yeah, now Jurassic Park is the end-all, be-all. Jurassic World's pretty good. But I doubt Joel's seen that. <laughs> Triceratops Winnie. What's this over here? Stegosaurus. Whoa, this one's brain was the size of a walnut. No, no way. Looks like you two have something in common. <laughs> oh, <laughs> good one. Let's check over here. Triceratops. Hello, Winnie. Triceratops means three horned face. You would not want to be on the business end of that horn. Or any end. That thing was massive. This is a Brachiosaurus. There's one I recognize. Hmm. Can we take a good look at this one? Brachiosaurus. This thing was massive too. What do you got over here? Dimetrodon? Dimetrodon? Dimetrodon. Dimetrodon was an apex predator. It's an apex predator. Top of his class. The most badass predator. Huh. Pretty short for that. Wait, were you talking about me? <laughs> Looks like a massive iguana. <laughs> Joel! Perfect. <laughs> That is a hat on a dinosaur. It's called a hatosaur. <laughs> Let's get that hat back. All right, let's check out over here. See if there's anything down here. Ooh, can I keep this? The Nighthawk trading card. I guess I can, right? Oh, cool. You're definitely a hero. What you got there? These uh, superhero cards. Seems like they were popular. That's cool. I think Sarah was into those for a while. Where's the little 
creature things. I forget. What little creature things? Now you're gonna have to wash your arm. Head. Face. <laughs> Up. Good smile. Down. <laughs> okay, let's go. I like this part. Let's go, Joel. You're already one step ahead of us. Feeling like you're on the next on the extinction list? Don't worry, we've got you covered. Stop by the cafe today. Oh yeah, we gotta get there. See what Joel has to say about his coffee addiction. What are these? Gallimimus's name means chicken mimic. I, who names these? Scientist. <laughs> Old guys. Well, they're dumb. Chicken mimic. Okay. Ah, uh, here we go. Brachiosaurus. Brachiosaurus ate 600 pounds of plants each day. Whew. Imagine the poops. Yeah, there's one scene where, uh, actually one of the guys said, that's a big mound of shit. <laughs> <laughs> what is this movie, and when can we see it? Tell you what, when we get back to Jackson, movie night. Please tell me she's seen Jurassic Park. She'd probably love that movie. What's this? This looks like something underwater. Yeah, all these, um, Nautilus shells. Does this say anything? No, it doesn't. Alright, let's check over here. We already checked out the Stegosaurus. Let's check down here. What do we got? Got some more fossils. Look how thick this one's skull is. Kinda looks like... Tommy. <laughs> I'm telling him you said that. Please don't. Catch it in the right light. Boom. Tell me. <laughs> Alright, let's get moving. Over Raptor? Whoa, this one looks like a bird. Well, actually, paleontologists believe the birds were descended from dinosaurs. Well, excuse me, Mr. Professor. <laughs> I happen to know a thing or two. From a movie. Keep going. What do we got here? What are you guys? Hey, is this gonna be a thing? Oh, of course. Please don't let it be a thing. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad she doesn't have a camera. Oh, man. She did mention wanting a camera back when Shimmer was still alive. Oh, yeah. These guys. Smack you with the tail, it's all over. Alright, I think we're good in this room. We could probably head upstairs now. Yeah, let's head upstairs. Oh wait, there's another hat for Joel. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Yeah, sir. One second. I swear that girl dragged me to every damn museum in Texas. Can I grab this hat? Oh man. That was definitely a hat for Joel. I think I missed that. Oh well. Let's keep moving. I saw that out the corner of my eye, I guess it was too late. Time for you to get a hat. Looks like a giraffe. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Hey! Nice job. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't miss that. I see the appeal. <laughs> Told you. Alright, let's go. Extinction. Yeah, they were all wiped out by a meteor. Oh, are we getting to a planetarium? No freaking way. I think we're getting to the planetarium. Come on, Joel. Hey, walk <gasps> through the stars. Did you know this was here? Astronauts. Oh, you don't like it. Um, we can head back. <laughs> oh, shut up. Yep, I'm guessing this is where her astronaut fascination came with now. Oh. Hey, Joel, can you name all the planets? 
My very educated mother just served us nice pizzas. <laughs> uh, That's perfect. Have a stroke? Mercury Venus. Mercury. Very Venus. Mother Mars. Oh, okay. I get it. That's pretty cool. Jupiter. Saturn. Uranus. I forget the rest. Something about pizzas. Pluto, of course. Alright, let's go. Vostok K. Guess what the first animal to go to space was? A monkey. I have to guess that was a monkey. No, it was fruit flies. Yeah, in 1947. Oh. It was to see radiation exposure at high altitudes. And they lived through it. Dad gum, bro, you are smart. <laughs> Thanks. Dad Did gum. They become super fly. What? No. <laughs> Whoa. Tell me another fun fact. Hmm. Astronauts say the moon smells like gunpowder. That is a fun fact. Well, wait, how would they... Sp oh, well, they would take the moon samples back inside and smell them later, I guess. Fair enough. That's logical. Okay, what's next? You tell me. Uh, quiz me. <laughs> I don't know... Who was the first person in space? Oh, it's easy. Yuri Gagarin. Gagarin? Is that... Gagarin? I don't know how you say it. I've only read it, so... Anyway. He flew to space on April 12th, 1961. Color me impressed. I'm impressed. I don't know half these facts. Books. Have you read about this? Come on, Joel. Isn't that incredible? Why don't you tell me what you like about it? Hmm... I don't know. People in your time... They had it easy. Hmm. Did they? I guess relatively speaking, sure. I mean, they didn't need to go to space, but they did it anyway. It's... Ballsy. <laughs> ballsy. Alright, you. Kid. Now I get it. Let's check out over here. Is this how big the rover was? Because this is actually pretty huge. Oh, fuck yeah. Where's the steering wheel? Rovers don't use steering wheels. They use joysticks. Huh. Hang on. Is this the real one? Well, considering they left the real ones on the moon, I would say no. <laughs> But question is, were they that big? Because if they were, good lord. What do we got here? Journal entry. Let's take a look at that. One day. Yeah, hopefully. Wow. Dina made me a crown for my birthday. She went back to that camp and got all this paper. It's pretty great. Cat sat next to me. At movie night, our elbows kept touching. I think she was doing it on purpose. I don't know. Maybe not. Probably not. Joel said he's taking me on a camping trip next week for my birthday. He found something he said I love. He's act he's acting very proud of himself. Smuggle foggy. It's her birthday? Wow. Tommy and Joel. Farm rotation blows. I don't get why people act for this assignment. Note to self, talk to Maria about how early I can get sign up for patrol training. Dana and I found this cool old campground today. She said kids used to go there in the summers for fun. We found all these art supplies. She cut colored paper and made some crowns for us while it rained outside. It was a good day. Looks like she drew Dina. We didn't get to see this one. That's cool. Alright, what else have we got? Pictures of deer. Okay. Yeah, I love this journal mechanic. It's so good. Alright. That's one way we can go. Space tactics. Space shuttle tiles. Skylab. These are all satellites. Alright, let's get over to the main room. This, uh, drop pod. Whoa. <laughs> huh. 
But now hold on just a minute. We're going into space. You're gonna need a helmet. <laughs> oh god. Oh, great. What was I thinking? Gosh, amateur. Let's see, what do we got? We got this one. Alright, we're probably gonna pick that one. I like that one. What else do we have? This one looks like a racing helmet. That's a big one right there. This one looks cool. Alright, let's go grab that orange one. Gemini spacesuit. This is gonna be way too big for my head. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> That's great. How does it smell in there? Terrible. Like space. And dust. That's amazing. Alright, let's go. After you. This fit three people? No freaking way. Watch your head. Watch your gun. <laughs> what the heck? Where's your helmet, Joel? Okay. <laughs> Happy birthday, kiddo. What is this? This is a thing that took a mighty effort to find. Take it. Hell yeah. Are you fucking kidding me? Happy birthday, Ellie. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, kiddo. <laughs> well, what do you say we uh, keep looking around, huh? This whole day planned. Damn, Joel. That's awesome. That's really freaking awesome. All right, 
right, let's get back at it. Looks like we're going to that exit over there. Yeah. All right, let's get to it. Definitely an amazing birthday. We're going out this way. Where's that cafe? There's more museum stuff over there. So we can get Joel some coffee. Yeah, I never checked out that building. Well, let's go. And just how do you plan on getting yourself over there? Easy. <laughs> Every chance we get, we try to give Joel a heart attack. Get down here! No! Hey! Come on, Joel. Is it? You can't keep doing that. My poor cassette player. We've got more exploring to do. I'm glad we found a waterproof. There we go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm glad we found a waterproof cassette player. You good, Joel? All right, let's go. Locked up. That sucks. Hey, who's being there? I don't know. I'll open the door for you. Come on, we can't chicken out now. Come on, Joel. All right, up we go. I'm really surprised this place hasn't been touched by the infection, but. I guess we'll see okay, that soon, huh? Bad news. There's shit blocking the door. Well, see if you can find me another way in. I'll I'll walk around the outside. Okay, be safe. You be safe. There are dinosaurs around. We got our gun. Okay, we can switch to our gun. Yep, we have access to our gun, which means we're going to be getting into some stuff. Whoa. Oof. Stay strong, buddy. Pack of wolves on a moose. I killed for them. What the hell? Okay. Things are gonna get real interesting real soon. Sara training card. Villain. Neutral villain. Okay. Cool. Got some bison over here. What's this? Some goats? Bighorn. I killed for them. What the hell? I needed a hug. Can I get some more birds? It's dark in here. The four soldiers at the gate. The last one cried. Okay, this is getting creepy now. What the hell? Oh, shit. The woman we tortured choked on her own blood. Is it infected? Can't tell. There's a bottle over here. Did my flashlight go out? The first time in all that I've been playing in this game, the stragglers who snuck into camp, they just wanted food. The kid who ran into the blast, I couldn't stop him. Come out, fucker. Do we have listen mode? Okay, good, we do. I tried to do this earlier and it didn't work, of course. The people in the van, I've locked them in and doused it with gas. Jeez. Molotov? Okay, not yet. Can't go that way. Got some raccoons. What is this, the Natural Life Museum? Okay, we got some stuff over there. What does this say? There is no light. Who the hell is writing all this stuff? Do we have another note here? 
We wanted to end suffering, we wanted to restore humanity. Each time we sacrificed part of ourselves, our leaders kept saying it'll be worth it. Now we've disbanded, with nothing to show for our sins. I thought coming here might reignite something, some purpose. My parents love bringing me here. It's one of my earliest memories from before the outbreak, before all of the cruelty and savagery. Those memories just made me angrier. I don't want to be in this world anymore. I can't look at the person I've become. Okay. Jeez. Okay, we can't make a Molotov yet. Let's reload. Come on, Ellie. Walls. Wall. Stupid fake animals. Whoa, 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 whoa. A boar? Holy shit. Oh, man. Come on, Ellie. Liars. Ellie? I'm in here. Who <laughs> was it? It's just some animal. Fireflies. Well, let's get a move on. I want to get a fire going before it gets too dark. Come on. Okay. Wow. What a birthday. Seattle Day 2. The radio's working. Hope Dina's okay. But. This has been a good episode. And I think this is a pretty safe place to stop. So. If you guys enjoyed the episode. Please leave a like and consider subscribing. If you didn't however leave a comment. Let me know why. If you want more content you can follow on Twitter at Penarios Gaming. Or you can follow on Instagram at Penarios. You can also try joining the Discord, which I'm slowly putting together, which should be in the description of any of my videos. But with that said, I will see you on the next one. Later.